This is a Kyberlite Samurai blade. It's a flat acrylic lightsaber blade manufactured by Kyberlite. And so, you know, they have, Kyberlite has a line of four different designs of flat acrylic lightsaber blades. This is the kind of katana style lightsaber blade that they make. And so taking a little bit of a closer look at this specific one, um, well, this blade is not symmetrical. So it's, it's shaped, you know, much like a katana or, you know, an yaito, if you do that type of thing. And you have the long edge on this end, and then it's a little bit of a shorter edge here. Although you see the frosted portion of the edges, it's uh, definitely a little bit wider on this side and a little bit more narrow on the long end. And so everything comes together in this sort of asymmetrical point at the top, but it's not super pointy, which is good. Um, but you know, even so, flat acrylic blades, you know, by any company, whether it's Kyberlite or anybody else, they're not designed for dueling. The acrylic plastic, is, it's just, uh, it's not quite durable enough. It's a little too brittle. And so it's, you know, intended to be a, a show blade or, you know, it's for display. It's not for dueling. So keep that in mind. We have some really cool blade lightning in the middle. It's just in the kind of clear portion in the center. So we have sort of two colors to this blade. We have the kind of frosted edges to it um, that are a little bit opaque. And then we have this kind of super clear, um, you know, window-like um, center section to the blade. And that's where we have the opaque uh, blade lightning that kind of offsets that um, transparent center of the blade. So there's some really nice detail to it. And this whole blade, um, you know, the length of the entire visible blade is 29 inches. So that's pretty good length. And then finally at the end, we have the stem or the tang. And so that's where the flat blade section kind of attaches to this cylindrical piece that you can connect to your lightsaber. So this is a one inch diameter tang and it can uh, fit in lightsabers from various custom saber companies that are designed to accommodate a one inch diameter blade. So let's attach it to a hilt. We got to do that. This is, um, excuse me, I'm attaching it to a Kyberlite hilt. And it, you know, looks really cool. It looks different with the different colors. So you can kind of, especially if you have an RGB lightsaber like a Kyberlite, or, you know, a lot of other people make RGB sabers now, um, you can kind of select color that you like and change it around too. Of course, white is optimal. That's how you'll see the details in the blade the most and kind of the best. So that's just some of the colors, so you get the idea. Uh, yeah, this has just been kind of a look at the Kyberlite Samurai Blade. It's this Japanese sword-inspired flat acrylic blade that's manufactured by Kyberlite. And if you're interested, I'll link to it below.